welcome to this class uh, in this tutorial we want to solve these uh, radical equations and uh, looking at this so we can, we can just firstly take the square root side and uh, we keep expanding but that uh, will be the long process uh, here is the short method of solving this we are just coming to this channel please do it to subscribe and here we are going to let root x plus 2 to be equals to a letter which is letter t and here we know that this capital letter t uh, sorry the t is greater than zero so if t greater than zero so we are going to manipulate the second one which is root x minus 2 and for this is going to be t minus 4 so because if we try to collect the like terms by right, transferring this negative 4 to the right and uh, to the left hand side so we are going to get root x plus 2 which is t above so on getting these two we are going to come back to the original equation which is a bigger root and we try to replace all this value as uh, t divided by t minus 4 divided by t minus 4 everything equals to t then uh, we cannot take the square of both sides so by taking the square of both sides we have uh, the result of this becomes t divided by t minus 4 equals to t raised to the power of 2 and uh, by cross multiplying so this t square is just like t divided by 1 so we are going to cross multiply and uh, we are going to have this result as so if t square multiplies t minus 4 so this is equals to t and uh, so if we take this t to the left hand side so we have t square bracket t minus 4 minus t everything equals to 0 so if we try to expand this as a to have a cubic root uh, equation so that is going to be a long process so what we are going to do here is so we are going to factorize out t so by factorizing out t here is going to make the words very easy to solve so here becomes t bracket t minus 4 bracket minus 1 everything equals to zero so this is not making sense and it has already simplified so we are going to let t equals to zero or the other one equals to zero so as t equals to zero here we should know that this t equals to zero is not going to be equal as uh, the value is going to be uh, negative so we consider t greater than zero not t um, equals to zero okay so and uh, we still don't consider t less than zero so at this point so you know that t equals to zero there is no solution to this so we go for the second one so which is t bracket t minus four minus one everything equals to zero so for this one if we try to expand this so uh, we are going to get a quadratic uh, expression or let me say a quadratic equation so we have t square minus 40 minus 1 everything equals to 0 so at this stage so you can you cannot apply the factorization method and i don't want to use the quadratic formula what i will do is i'm going to use the computing the square method so to do that we are going to transfer negative one to other side which is this and uh, so you know from these two sides if i decide to add 4 to both sides so we have this as t square minus 40 plus 4 so this equals to 1 plus 4 so as 4 we cancel 4 if 4 cancel 4 we are still coming back to this equation so and uh, this t square minus 40 plus 4 is just as t minus 2 raised to the power of 2 and this equals to 1 plus 4 that is 5 so then we cannot take the square root of both sides so just to eliminate the square at t minus 2 so on the that you have t minus 2 raised to the power of 2 so all uh, square root equals to plus or minus root 5 and these two we cancel each other then we have t minus 5 uh, minus 2 equals to plus or minus root 5 so since we are looking for t then we are going to get t equals to 2 plus or minus root 5 but the, consist uh, the condition still holds because this is just like two values for t so t1 equals to 2 plus root 5 and uh, t2 equals to 2 minus root 5 so at uh, t is always greater than 0 so if t greater than 0 so we are going to uh, have this so you know this is still less than 0 that is not correct so we cancel this and uh, we go for t equals to 2 plus root 5 so which is greater than 0 then uh, we now come back to where we let 
which is root x plus 2 equals to t. So I will try to replace the value of t, so which is 2 plus root 5, just to get the value of uh, x. So we have this as root x plus 2 equals to 2 plus root 5. And uh, so by taking 2 to the other side, so we have root x left, which is equals to 2 plus root 5 minus 2. So as we transfer 2 to the other side. So we know that these two we cancel this and we have root x equals to 5. Uh, uh, root 5 as the value of x equals to uh, equals to 5. <laughs> so and here is the solution for this, which is as equals to 5. But note that so we still go for the negative uh for the for the negative side, which is x 2 minus root 5, and try to square it. So there's going to be negation of that negative because of the square. And this is how to solve it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Bye bye. <laughs>